Now there is a limited number of ways that you can edit audio clips in FMOD, but they can come in handy. The first one is if you were to hover your cursor over either end of your audio clip, you'll get a double arrow like this one, and you can trim the length of the clip from either end. And if you hover your cursor up in either corner, then you can add a fade, and you can use this little dot here to actually change the gradient of that fade. And you can always use Command Z to undo any changes. Also, if you place your timeline cursor somewhere along the clip, then you can right click there and you can go split and chop your clip in half. This is non-destructive, so you can always drag it out. But the other thing you can do is if you right click on one of these trimmed clips, is you can say replace audio with trimmed copy. Now this will keep the original full length clip, but will make a new clip, as you can see in your assets bin, that it'll have the same name clip, but with trimmed. And that will be the same length as the one that you originally trimmed. Now, one last thing to note is that if there is another option when you right click on a clip, and that is to resize to contents length. Now, something that I've found with this is that if I have trimmed the front off of a clip rather than the back of it and right click and go to resize contents length, it will resize it to the original length of the content but will extend it into silence. Whereas if you were to trim the clip from the end of the clip, and do that, then for some reason it only resizes to the original length from the end of the clip, never from the start.